So, you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's them. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for a level of violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gain any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. It is that you encounter a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you run away, you did it with a smile. You never gain love, but you gain love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Thank you, Sans. I know what I said earlier that I'm tired of all these battles and such. But this is the final battle. I've come this far. I came back to this freaking game because I wanted to complete it. Not for me, actually. I wanted to complete it for you guys who are watching right now. Because you asked for this game. I do like this game. I love this story. But I dislike the battles because I'm very bad at dodging stuff. But even though, I still want to do this. Because I'm doing it for you. Because you're here for me too. So thank you everyone. This is the final battle, so let's go. It's time to face what I hate the most in this game, but at the same time this game is freaking great. Because the story so far has been freaking great. And I love it. I love how things have been so far. Throne room. Alright Asgore, I'm ready for you. I just wish these stars could give me one last message about the determination, you know. There's a crack here on the wall. It doesn't really mean anything. But yeah. Let's go, guys. Oh, what? It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. There. It's empty. Oh dear. So this is the garden. Hey, Asgore. Dum de dum. Oh, there's someone there. Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy. How can I? Oh!
I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But... You know how it is. A nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming, perfect weather for a game of catch. What? Are you going to catch me? Well, I'm here, let's go. Catch me. You know what we must do? When you are ready, come into the next room. You know... Wait, I have a feeling... If I save the pie... I got from Toril. It may have helped me in this battle, I don't know, because they're friends. I have no idea, man. But I really, really wish I... Had some more food. Because, well... Yeah. I would probably die a lot of times. But I'm ready for it. What's this? It's another throne covered by a white sheet. Can I move it? No? How about this one? It's a throne. Yeah, I know that. How tense. Just think of it like... A visit to the dentist. This all seems so familiar. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. But... What's going to happen? We're going to fight, right? You're, go you're going to kill me? That's how things are, right? Right? This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If... If by chance you have any unfinished business, please, do what you must. Well, I didn't see any shop for me to buy any food, but I do have the option to go back and try to find something, but at the same time, screw it, I'm going, let's go. I see. This is it, then. Ready? A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with DETERMINATION! Oh. Okay. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh dear. You removed the spare option. Alright, I know how you feel about this. Let's talk. Oh, whoa! Wait, I've seen... What? What's going on with my heart? Whoa. Well, I'm going to die. I'm so going to die. Well, I'm done. So, let's have a talk again. Let's die. I'm going to die. Yeah.
Uh. So, the other Zoe this. I remember the day after my son died. The entire undergrad was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then, I will destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon, their people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just want everyone to have hope. But I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. You guys know what I'm going to do here right now. And you know as well as Gore. Up until this point, I've been doing nothing but showing you mercy. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface. Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like, like a family. What? Flowey? Is that you? What's going on? Oh, I knew it. You idiot! You haven't learned a thing! In this world, it's kill or be killed. What's going on? What? Continue? What happened? What? What's... Wait, what? What's going on? Howdy! It's me, Flowey! Flowey the flower! I owe you a huge thanks! You really did a number on that fool! Without you, I never could have gotten past him! But now, with your help, he's dead! And I've got the human souls! Boy! I've been empty for so long! 
It feels great to have Saul inside me again. Mmm, I can feel the wriggling. Aw, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more. Before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers. Monsters. Humans. Everyone. I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Oh, I forget about escaping to your old save file. It's gone forever. But don't worry. Your old friend Flowey has worked at a replacement for you. I'll save over your own death. So you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over again. What? Do you really think you can stop me? <laughs> You really are an idiot. No, 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 no. I thought this was the last fight. I thought this was the last fight. I thought the fight with Asko was the last one. And now Flowey is screwing me over. Whoa. Oh my gosh. What? What? What the hell? Am I supposed to survive this? What's going on? This is all just a bad dream? And you're never waking up! What? 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 Did the, did the game crash? <laughs> did you really think I was gonna be satisfied killing you only one time? What the hell is going on? The game is crashing. Uh, what? I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Pathetic! Now you're really gonna die! Am I supposed to die all these times or what the hell is going on? Because this this fight against Flowey seems impossible. But I'm trying my best though. What am I supposed to do? I'm just moving around. What? 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 What the hell is going on? I I'm literally dying in here. We call for help. I need help. What? Oh. 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 What? Oh dear. No, not again, not again. What the heck? What? What? What the heck? What's going on? I don't even know where I am.
Well, this is something special. Hello. Okay. Oh my gosh, I don't have enough numbers. Seriously! Can you please stop this? How to save? What the, what the hell is this supposed to mean? I'm dying here. I don't know where I am. That's what will happen if you defeat me. No? I have no idea. Stop laughing, please. I have no idea what's happening right now. What? Oh my gosh, what the hell? This is crazy, man! This is crazy! Don't you get it? There's no such thing as happy endings. This is all that's left. Honestly, this is not what I expected from Undertale at all. Like, what the hell is going on, Alice This is too weird to me. Okay, you need to stop these freaking attacks of yours. How the freaking are they? I'm like, what? Can you please relax with your attacks? You are seriously. Oh my gosh, are you really that desperate? <laughs> laugh all you want. You can laugh all the freaking hell you want, man. But I'm not dumb. I'm far from dumb. Gosh, Chloe, Chloe, please. What? Whoa, wait, wait. Whoa, okay. I can do this. I can do it. This, this is not bad. I'm calling for help. I don't have enough help for this man. Honestly, fighting you is pretty fun. So even if you are a sick girl, I'll take it. Bring it on. Oh dear, what? Okay, this is fine. I call for help. But the message thing is kind of in the way right now. Oh. Okay. What? What's going on? The hearts? Oh, what? They're giving me health. Power's defense drop to zero. What was that supposed to be? Oh! Oh my god. I need more health, man. Give me more health. There we go.
I can do it. I can do it. I believe in myself. As a human being. Come on. Oh my gosh. I'm taking so much damage right now. Oh my gosh, please. Please, please let me do this. Please let me do this. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I believe. Come on. I'm beating you, Flowey. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my gosh, this is crazy, man. I did it! I did it! No! No! This can't be happening! You... You... What? You... Idiot! <laughs> Did you really think you could defeat me? I am the god of this world. And you? You're hopeless. Hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right. Your worthless friends can save you now. Call for help. I dare you. Cry into the darkness. Mommy, daddy, somebody help. See what the good it does you. But nobody came. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die. Yeah, what? How, how'd you... Well, I'll just... What's going on? What? What? Where are my powers? The souls? What are they doing? No! No! You can't do that! You're supposed to obey me! Stop! Stop it! Stop! I want to do this, but no. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. If you let me live, I'll come back. I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone. I'll kill everyone you love. Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. Flowey, run away.
I think I did it. Wait, where am I? Is this... Oh yeah. There is uh, anyone there? Well, uh, I'll just uh, leave a message. So, uh, it's been a while. The queen returned and uh, is now ruling over the underground. She is instead a new policy. All the humans who fall here will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. It's probably for the best anyway. The human souls the king gathered seem to have disappeared. So, uh, uh, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. But even though people are heartbroken over the king and things are looking grim for our freedom, the queen's trying our best not to let us give, us, give up hope. So, uh, uh, hey, if we're not giving up down here, don't give up wherever you are, okay? Who knows how long it will take, but we will get out of here. Sans! Who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? Here, knock yourself out. Wait a second. I recognize this number. Hey, human! How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Well, besides one thing... The Queen disbanded the Royal Guard! Since we don't have to fight humans anymore. Wow! I have no idea what to do with my life. But, uh, that's okay. Because I'm still working hard, even if it's done nothing at all. So, uh, don't feel bad. Papyrus is fine. And Dan is the one that's got it bad. She lost her job. Then she lost her house. It was sad, but we're taking care of her. She lives on her couch now. It's like a sleepover every night. A sleepover there's no escape from. Oh, we gave her a job too. Sounds hired her at this illegal hot dog stand. She's working there, but uh, she makes some meat hot dog. Oh, yeah. She still blames you for the disappearance of Asgor. She talks to me a lot about getting revenge on you. She has a ludicrous plan to cross the barrier and beat you up. To be honest, I think it's impossible, but I like to believe it's not, because I want to go with her. Then I'd get to see you again, even if I'd have to fight you. Well, keep your fingers crossed, and keep in touch. It will make our plans easier. Bye! Why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends. But now, you'll probably never see them again. Not to mention how much they've been set back by you. Hurts, doesn't it? If you had just gone through without caring about anyone, you wouldn't have to feel bad now. So, I don't get it. If you really did everything the right way, why do things still end up like this? Why? Is life really that unfair? Say, what if I told you? I need some way to get to a better ending. You have to load your save file and, uh, well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Undyne? It seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to her happiness. See you soon. <laughs>